Hello and welcome to a bit of a different video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to buy ridiculously rare players, like players that you can't even find on the market, like this man of the match, Vidal. I'm going to show you guys how to actually buy them, how to get them to come up on the market and how you can be the one to pick them up. If you do enjoy this video, I know it's a little bit different, I don't usually do tutorials and stuff, but I did a seven minute squads on this Vidal the other day and you guys just wanted to know how I actually managed to get hold of him to put him in a squad because he is just so ridiculously rare. He's re just stupidly underpriced because of the price caps and he's orange and he's only in packs for 24 hours and then we've got the likes of that Balassi that everybody loves, but Again, because he's so cheap and he's a position change and everyone wants him. People who pack him aren't selling him and people, just everyone in the world wants to buy him. And he's so hard to get off the market. So I thought I would show you guys a little technique to be able to do it. So if you do enjoy this video, make sure you smash that like button. If you could hit 5,000 likes in 24 hours, I will know that this tip has helped you guys out massively. And I'll bring you more stuff that you guys would like to see. So anything else you want to know, just pop it down in the comment section as well. And let's jump over into the transfer list now. I can't show you with that Vidal because I've already got one and I don't want to buy another one. That just seems a little bit stupid. I don't need two Vidals, even though he would sell instantly. I would lose the EA tax. So instead, we're going to be showing you guys with this Balassi. This is the Inform one. If you guys don't know how to get him to come up, so you just search for a specific Inform. Go and put him in a Concept Squad. Do the search in the Concept Squad and then when you come back to the normal transfer market, he'll be there for you guys. If you want to go and get any coins to buy any of these players, be it this Balassi, the Vidal, anyone like that, prices start at £2.50 per million, which is mental. That is on PS4, Xbox is a lot more expensive and takes a little bit longer to come. But go and check them out, they're nice and cheap. The link is down in the description and the discount code AJ3 gets you 8% off. But this Balassi that we've got here, we're going to try and buy one. And I'll show you guys me actually trying to buy one and hopefully picking one up. It shouldn't take me too long with this technique. But... Basically, if you just search, nothing is going to come up on the market. And if you just keep searching over and over and over again, this doesn't actually refresh the search. And it doesn't check again. It thinks, oh, you've already searched in the last 30 seconds. Nothing has come up. And we're just going to tell you nothing has come up again. So basically, the search will only refresh 30 seconds if you just keep spam searching over and over and over again. So not only do you have a tiny, tiny chance of picking one up anyway, your chance is 1 in 30 smaller, which is just mental, because it'll only refresh the search once every 30 seconds. So you need a way to make it check every single time that you press that search button to see if a card has popped up on the market within the last second or so. So the way to do that is to simply just change what you search for every single time. So you can do it by jumping between searching for gold and then searching for any, and then searching for gold and then searching for any, or you can do it by searching 150, if nothing comes up, 200, 250, 300 and just keep doing it like that and um, it takes a while I'm not gonna lie it will take you a while to pick up some of these players like I said everyone wants to buy them and everyone who packs them doesn't want to sell them or very few people who pack them want to sell them so it will take you a while but I'm going to show you guys how to do it that basically just shows you guys how to do it it's literally just this and their patience this makes them come up every single time so every time one pops up on the market you will see it because your search gets refreshed every single time you search and then basically you've just got to have the patience to sit here until one pops on pops up on the market and then buy it when it does and just be the first one to click that buy now button as well. So that is it basically lads, that is the technique. Just change what you search for every single time but obviously keep the parameters in what he will come up for. So switching between gold and any for a gold card or silver and any or changing the price whilst keeping it still in his brackets will make the search refresh every single time and you can pick them up. So that is what I'm going to do now. I'm going to go away, try and buy one of these guys and just show you guys that it is possible to do. Oh, I missed one, you fucker. That's the first one I've seen. Bastard. Got to be fast on the buttons when you actually get to them as well. Oh, come on. Yes, there we go, boys. There we go. Fucking Balassi in the bag. It took me a whopping... 20 minutes roughly fuck me but there we go we have managed to get ourselves hold on let's stick them in our club so there it is lads there is the balassi that i originally put in this concept squad to get him to come up on the market to be able to search over there like that and you can see he's now being replaced by this balassi that i just bought for 60,000 coins four star weak foot five star skills 79 rated center attack and mid this is ridiculously good absolute bargain which is why he's so rare 
but I've picked my cell phone up and he looks stupid and I am very pleased with that. So that is where we're going to leave this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, like I said, make sure you smash that like button. If we get to 5,000 in 24 hours, I will bring you a tip, basically the top commented thing in this. So thumb up ones that you really want to see. And if you guys smash the like button, I will bring you some more stuff and teach you guys some more stuff about FIFA 15 that you might not have known. But that is where we're going to leave it. Make sure you subscribe if you're new around here. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.